Hello, I'm Bernard Hickey from interest.co.nz and welcome to 90 at 9, brought to you in association with Bank of New Zealand. This is your morning briefing where you get everything you need to know in 90 seconds at 9 o'clock. Starting now with news this week, the Reserve Bank will give its interest rates decision on Thursday in the monetary policy statement for the December quarter. It's likely to leave the official cash rate on hold, say economists, and leave it there through almost all of 2012. The markets, however, aren't quite so sure. They were saying just a few weeks ago that we could have a cut in the next year or so. Now they don't expect a cut on Thursday, but maybe next year. It all depends on how bad this European financial crisis gets. Looking across the Tasman tomorrow, the Reserve Bank of Australia is expected to cut interest rates there. They really have a two-speed economy. Retailing and manufacturing are really struggling. Of course, the mining sector is still booming. Also news out over the weekend on Chinese non-manufacturing output. That means for construction, retail and property. They actually contracted in November and shows there's the risk in China of a hard landing. Important, of course, for New Zealand and Australia, it is our largest trading partner. Meanwhile, trade tensions are brewing between China and America. America has just launched an anti-dumping action over Chinese exports of solar panels to America. America says they have been subsidised by the Chinese and the Chinese are holding their currency down. That's penalising the manufacturers in America of solar panels. This is a worry, of course, during the 30s, after the Depression, there were many anti-dumping actions and trade tariffs and various trade barriers that stopped trade between countries. I'm Bernard Hickey. That was 90 at 9, brought to you in association with Bank of New Zealand.